Hello, this is Discovering Watchmen. I thank you so much for your comment and contribution to this channel. And this is the only channel that brings the latest to your knowledge and what you need to know as long as discovering is concerned. Thank you for your comment, thank you for your subscription to the channel. Thank you for this the sharing of this video to your friends, to your family and the loved one. When today we are going to discuss something that is very important, which I know will be of immense benefit to you and also to your friend, I am going to discuss on how to design a 50 kVA kW seven generator. How to design a 50 kW seven generator like kilowatt generator. Many of you know what a 50 kilowatts is all about. It's a very big engine. It might be a very big engine. But first of all, I want to tell you, many people have been asking a lot of questions about does this serve, does serve generator exist? Does this electric generator, generator without fuel, does it really work? Is it existing? I want to tell you that yes, it's existing. We have designed, we have do testing, we have implemented it, and it's working. Several generators, just like as you are aware that electric cars are also existing, you can also refer to my previous video about how electric car works. You know, this, these things are working, these things are working perfectly. There's no there's no fake about it, it's just a matter of understanding how it works. And you will know that these things are working, you can even do it for yourself. It's just a simple thing you can do, just have the materials you want to use in doing it, and you will do it for yourself. That I'm going to do. So in this video, I'm going to explain, I'm going to show you how this is done. I'm going to show you the secret. I'm going to tell you the different method you can use in designing this cell generator. I'm going to show you the component. I'm going to also show the techniques which is hidden, which many people don't want you to know. I'm going to show you in this video. I'm going to say it. Now, let's, let's see what is self what is self generator is about what is a self generator what does what do we talk when we talk about self generator what do we really mean you see many people don't really understand what self generator is about but i want to explain that self generator is an electrical device that generates electricity in the absence of petrol kerosene diesel or any other liquid except electric so anything had to do with generating of light without fuel, petrol or diesel gas you just know that this thing is a self launch generator this is what it means it's not something so big we can talk about solar energy which is also self generator because it does not use light does not use does not use uh, water does not use uh, uh, petrol or anything it can call it a self generator so you can talk about two uh, uh the same uh, two by which is about wind but in this place we're going to talk about seven generator using generator itself using something like this how to do with generator so this is where we are focusing today so a typical self generator now if you look very critical in this video you're going to see generator here this is generator this generator is very important is this is where the light is being generated if i said earlier in my, my previous video that the generator does not really need water or does not need diesel does not need fuel does not need kerosene to run what it just need it need an equipment that can help itself to turn that what it needs if you have the power as a human being to turn this generator in a very high frequency it will still have light it will still need light what it just need on its own it just have it's a, a device or anything that can turn it if it if it can be turned by any device it will still carry generate light so it does not need that okay you must you must have a diesel base before you can have light or you may have a fuel base for you no it, the fuel base is only used for American session just like diesel just diesel there has an own engine that requires sulfur to, to run the parts to be able to turn the this one so but in this case we have a simple device that helps to turn this thing and that is what we call electric motor this electric motor duty is just to turn you know some of us know the word electric motor is about the electric motor's duty is just to turn does not need too much power as long if you connect it to the power source 
you just see spinning is that so now what we do here now we connect this electric motor to the to the the electric generator generator using something like this which is the i call it the flyway the flyway now join the two things together and when the two things are joined together as this one is connected to the parcel the lights this this start turning this uh motor start turning as the motor start turning this uh generator automatically will start turn also and when it turns the light comes in and when the light comes in the light moves directly to the panel where this motor is connected to so the motor now also feel on this light that comes from this man this device so the motor also feel from the light because when this one generates light the light is being sent to the, the panel and when the panel now the way the motor is the motor so this one also feel from the light that comes from this place we want to understand it better as we go further but let's now see the components these are the these are generator these are the electric motor these are the flywheel and it's the bed the bed that joined the two flyways. Sometimes the flyway need a bed to join it together to remove the top. So as you can see here, this is the bed here. So this is a simple aspect which you need to know. The generator here, the motor, the the flyway, and the bed. These are the four components you need as far as to generate a uh, seven generator to generate free light or seven generator is concerned. You must have these three four components. If you have these four components in your place, you have this component in your in your house, you have this component four component in your production radio, you will surely produce this this uh seven generator. It's not difficult. Now let's move further to this this thing. Yes, this is very important because many have been having this dispute. I say how now how do you run this seven generator without fuel, without um, petrol what is its power source this is where it com basically comes now how does it works see this here you see it here is the external power source this external power source give light to this man this man here this this is this man this is this device now if the device is turning it start turning there's a joint this which can be called flyway if you call it flyway you're not wrong there's a joint here it is this joint that join the two devices together now in this joint as this motor is turning this generator is also turning and if this generator is turning now there will be what we call external power source that is the bit like there will be output power because that's why you have this apple power here. So this power, apple power comes from the generator, which is as result of this man, this power, this horsepower here, which is the power house here, as result of the turning of this man. And this one is because of the the in, in power that come into it that enable it to turn, and it have to turn this one, and there's output power. Now, what's something here? There is a two cables here. These two cables that are linked. There is positive and negative cables. This positive and negative will are joined to this out power. This out power here are joined here. This is the tap light from this out power to this motor. This is where we have the seven generator coming in. Now when this this one turn to this run because of this power this one generated light because of this power these cables are now tapped from this place to enter the switch here this is a switch which is can also call it a control this switch control both this man and this one so this control control these two devices so if this one is tapped to this point now this to this place now you have to off this place off this power source on this uh, on this uh, switch and then the power from this place will automatically flow to this motor and when the power flow to this motor the motor remain turning so it means that this this generator will feed this one why there's no external power i don't know you understand the logic i i am going to produce uh, a better video on this diagram and i'm going to explain it in a more practical way but for now i just want you to have a picture of how 
a cell regenerator is because many don't believe that this regenerator is resistant. So I want you to use this picture to understand the logic, understand the simple secret on it. And if you understand the simple secret, you can produce any generator you want to produce, even 50 kVA, 200 kVA, 200 kVA, as many as possible you can produce, but just understand this part, the logic. This is a control area, and this tab, this tab comes to this place, to this place, and this tab comes to this place now. So as the two tab come to this place now, you switch off this area, and then on this area, which is a control area, and then this one half light. And when this one half light, it, this one will remain turn because this one is turning, this one still remains light. So the light moves from cycle form, it moves here to this point, and this one turn this one, and this one gives it this light on. Why this extra power source still remain? It's still getting power source because you, you, you what you will do, you will tap, you will tap, you tap only here. So it does not prevent a snap power source for your television, for your video, for your, for your fridge, for your AC, it does not affect it. Because you, what you let you let join this cable to this one, you join this. So the power will flow here, but you let this now move back to this place. It's okay. Since you turn me, I'm going to feed him with light. You turn me, I'm going to feed him with light. So as you keep turning me, I'm going to give you light. So what is doing? As you keep turning this man, this man still carry the light back to him. And so okay, continue turning me. I'll keep coming. In. So if you want, if you stop turning me, if you stop turning me. I'll stop, stop giving you light because this is where the light comes from. So it moves on cycle from here to this point. So I hope you understand the secret. But if you don't understand the secret, please subscribe to the channel. Give me your comment. Give me what area you have had problem, and I will still explain better. But also just watch out in this video of this same thing. I'm going to explain in a very very practical form this area because I know many people want to ask questions on this area so I'm going to explain in a very practical form but for now I'm only showing a little about what it means how how these two systems work together now watch this video and you appreciate this video is a product of one of the spheres is, um, of, of, of Gentech I'm going to see what I'm trying to do I want to use the explanation better for you now, now this is a number now you see this is this is the motor is turning now it's turning this one is generating light are you generating light see the light to the panel now see this is the casino now the light is coming out the light is coming because this generator now is giving light now to this place why the light also the, the cable here why this the generator is also sending light to this point it generates light here and send light also to this point this one this one generating light and send to this point this man and this man also using getting turning it only using the light that you get from him to turn. And this is the panel, this is where the, the old light comes, this is the panel where the, where the old light comes from now. So this turn and give this one and this one now turn and send some to him and they use some for the work now. As you can see I see now, this one and then I, he sends this to this man to his own work and then he also sends some to this one. So this is the distributing area. By here, okay, this is the stripping area where you get the distribution aspect. So you use this one to distribute the light and then go to this man and this man sent to him and also send to the other uh, device here. So he sent to this, this man here. So that is that is the system, this is how the self engineer work. Please thank you for watching this uh, this video. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel because we still have more better production, we still have more things to produce again in the future. Thank you very much and God bless.